Hey y'all, how's everyone doing? I've actually come to the place where I can reveal stage two of my blower project. So I'm going to do that here pretty soon, but I just wanted to talk about it a little bit. I did get the thing running. Um, however, I did hit a little bit of a snag. I was hoping this motor was going to vary its speed based on the voltage I input, but it really doesn't. No matter how low I go, it really ramps up high. And you guys will see that here in a second. I've actually got a special cable ordered from the dealertoolboxnetwork.com. And this is supposed to change an analog signal into a pulse. But this is all, you know, mad scientist type stuff anyway. And, uh, kind of, I get carried away doing little projects like this, so, um, just thought I'd show you guys what I got here. Alright, so here it is on my little workbench here. Um, so there we've got the, we've got the motor, motor mounted in there. Got the Gentech 3.0. You guys can see my little wire harness, homemade wire harness. I've got this secured pretty good there to it. Um, these are my low voltage leads coming into the motor, but check out this side over here. So here's my squared around that Ralph helped me make. So I put that little screen on it too. And uh, oh boy. That's what she's going to look like there. So what do you guys think I'm going to be doing with it? Feel free to guess and maybe you guys can actually figure it out. So. Right there, so there she is. Pretty cool. Alright okay, guys, so here we go. We'll run test it here. And by the way, this is just prototype stuff. When I was testing it, it was sucking so hard. It was sucking all kinds of leaves and dirt. I didn't want it to suck it into the motor. So here we go. I'm going to hook not this battery up to the motor here. Alright, run test complete.